Hi, this is BB. And yes, for certain individuals out there, nothing is happening to me. Let's just get that out of the way, shall we? After this part of the video, move it along very gently. Thank you. Bye now. Anyway, for the rest of you, um, it's like I, I had a nightmare. I had a nightmare. And it was a really bad nightmare. The thing is, for the first part of the night, I slept with my hat on. The second part, I woke up after the nightmare, and right across here is pain, and right still hurting. So it really was a really bad nightmare. Like somebody took a cigar and was trying to burn me in the mouth. I didn't feel any pain or anything. I don't know. Try to burn me in the mouth. And his eyes kept getting glazed over white. Like his white, his eyes would become white. Like it, ca it came and went. I looked closer and I was like, that's my uncle. My uncle who is sick, he's probably dying, I don't know. I don't want to say that. In his head, his head is swelling here. Somebody, two men beat the crap out of him. He has to get surgery to get a swelling down on his brain. They beat him up to a pulp. It's clot blood all over his head. My uncle would never do that. His biggest problem is he's an alcoholic. And being a little bit irresponsible with himself. That's his biggest, or two of his biggest problems, issues in life. So, the mere fact that this person would have to actually do that to my head, to create a nightmare, and, pl and plan the nightmare, to make me um, fearful says a lot. I'm sorry, I'm just tired. I also know that being tired all the time is not going to help. Because it's, I'm very frustrated right now. I can feel the frustration in my, in my, in my hands. The back of my spine. And in my chest. I'm just frustrated. But I can feel the pain over my head. I can feel the pain over my head. Now, to some of you out there, this is what I'm thinking. It doesn't matter. I'm not going to say it on here. I got to. I got to start filtering what I'm saying for legal purposes. Because if this goes to court, I'm basically giving them the, the defense on a platter. After all, the things that are happening to me, they're not supposed to know. If they know, then something is wrong. Because wherever she is, I have no idea. Wherever her family, her boyfriend, whoever, I don't know where, where these people are. I, like Literally, I have zero, less than zero ideas where they are. I know what they're capable of, but I don't know where they are. I just wanted to stop. She keeps pushing her agenda. Whatever this is, she just feels like she's going to take a chunk out of me. I don't understand what she's doing. I understand stamps are one thing. At first I thought, when I first learned of TIs and targeted individuals and gang stalkers, I thought I had it sewn up, you know, I had it sewn up in the bag. It was all about the stamps, but it's been too long. There's only one reason this would be going for this long. Is if in the accumulation of those stamps. In the accumulation of the stamps. Mother. In the accumulation of the stamps. That they hurt someone. Or maimed or injured someone to get them. And it's going to come back to bite them. 
But when what what is all of this shit right here? What is all of this shit right here? Doesn't make sense. Yeah, this will happen, of course, because she came close. All of this, it's the cat's fault. I've had her for 16 fucking years. 16 fucking years this has never happened. They're going to push the cat box, the, 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 the cat litter and the cat agenda now. Because there's someone on here saying that all the time. I say bullshit. My point though is the nightmare was very real. But the thing is, across my head hurt. Now, they had to actually do that for, to create the nightmare or, or to trigger the nightmare. I don't know. Seems a little artificial to me. My uncle can't even. Right now, he got beat up. And guess what? My cousin is saying it's because of some Spanish people. Now where my country is, there's Venezuela right next, close to it. My cousin is always talking about these Spanish people who are terrorizing my old country fellow men. I talk to my other cousin on my father's side. She has no clue what the other one is saying. She says she never heard anything about it. So, I, I don't know. There's, there's something wrong here. It's like this woman is turning my life, my family's life into a nightmare. And I know what she's doing here. This video is supposed to scare people. But I don't think she wants to scare people. I think she wants to separate people. She has an agenda. My guess is you guys get one of these hats. I won't tell you. You just go out there on YouTube, uh, not YouTube, Amazon and get one. Sleep with them at night if you have to. They're going to help. For the first part of the night, I slept with the hat. I didn't get the nightmare. Second part of the night, the neck right across my head here hurt. It wasn't demonic or angelic. Or otherworldly in any sense. It was artificially provoked. Artificially provoked. And the players were in this lifetime. Not some ancient forgotten civilization. Or demons wrestling each other. Or angels on harps. Sipping milk and honey. Earthbound people. My uncle. How she's able to do this, I have no idea. But she can. I couldn't be a fantasy. No, but that's not a fantasy. I have no idea. Well, people, people would have a, a field day. I'm thinking of somebody else. Of what they would, they would have a field day with it. And that's fine. But the point is, um, I don't, I don't understand what, um, what she would do. Is like what, what the hell that was. But I would suggest you, you guys get one of those hats. She sleep with them at night. To sleep with them, because right now <coughs> my ceiling is aluminum zinc. When you heat aluminum zinc, like you, you, you heat it up or something, what does it smell like? It has a sour metallic smell. I, it has a sour smell. It has a sour smell. I don't know. And you're getting mouthfuls of it. I, I have no idea. This, this itself would not be a problem. It doesn't matter where I live. If I live under a bridge, it wouldn't be a problem. Unless somebody is there making the, the general surroundings a problem for me. That's what she does. 
It doesn't matter where I go, this is the end result. What the fuck are they doing? I don't know. She's made me into this nightmare person. I don't think so. I think maybe it was a boyfriend. It was her. She is demonic in some way. I don't know. I have no idea. Or she thinks she's demonic. I don't know. I just want to... I just look at what, what, what they're doing. The modality. What, what, what are they doing? Who came up with this shit? Who came up with this shit? Who did? Who would have thought of this? And why? I certainly would have never thought of it to go doing it to someone. Why would you do this? Is this some kind of psychological warfare? Singling individuals or, or a group or a city or a town or a village? Shared nightmares? Send them all batshit crazy? A little bit at a time? Is the only way I could see? Or targeting individuals who are in positions of power? I guess she must be a wealthy woman. Or why is she taking it out on me? I don't know her. Because I don't understand this shit. I don't. I don't know what she's doing. She wants to create separations in my life, and now she's saying it, and that's okay. People have to keep themselves safe. And they will keep themselves safe. And that's important. This is what she wants. I guess she gets what she wants. And that would be me feeling petty and slighted, angry, frustrated. With well, a logical part of me wants people to be safe. Because I understand how dangerous these people are with this whatever the fuck they're doing. It's people to be protected. Who can't help themselves. And logic tells me that. So you guys should get this hat anyway. One and, and, and try it at night and make sure it, you know I won't tell you where. Just get any get one from Amazon. Invest in it if you can. You can find them for like 25, 30 bucks. They're not that expensive. So try it. Because this here is was artificially um, induced with these frequencies. So Keep you, try to keep your thoughts on an even keel and protect yourself and each other whenever you can.